Oh, hi guys. So, in honor of Christmas, well, we don't celebrate Christmas. Happy holidays. So, you had a wonderful whatever you celebrate. So, in honor of Christmas, because I celebrate Christmas, I decided to make a being in Hyper Roller Coaster and Ultimate Coaster 2. I'm using screen recording again because I really like it because. I just like. So let's go over the facts. So this coaster is being in hyper, obviously. And yes, I still have the box spine with the sit down trains. Hopefully, since this is posted on Christmas Eve, uh, hopefully, y'all end up with a Google Play card tomorrow. That's more than twenty dollars because I want all the tracks. So hopefully you lose. So the height is two hundred and twenty-five feet. The vertical angle is seventy-eight degrees. I'm not sure what's his negative seventy-eight degrees. Actually the height is two hundred and forty, but it has a two hundred and twenty-five foot drop. As you can see, you, have, you might think that's the turnaround. That is not. It goes along here. Then you have this long, drawn out turnaround. And so the train brakes, there's launches because they had an issue with the train brakes. So you get extra airtime. And yes, I know what airtime is. You know, I haven't posted that many roller coasters for you. So I don't want to talk about roller coasters all next year, most of the year. You know, it will be bridges and home vlogs and such. Let's take a ride. So, two minutes. So, you kind of go into a turn. Oops, sorry, I'm trying to sit here. You kind of go into a turn like Goliath at Six Flags over Georgia does. This one is taller, longer, faster. We're approaching this from 6.8 miles an hour to 9 to 12 and then to 22. It's the 22 miles an hour kind of boosts his speed to get you up that giant hill. The second hill. If you're wondering, yes, it's fixed up all the sounds. I'm gonna get my phone. Did you hear it clicks? That's my phone. Sorry about that. And you can see the launch with that boost of uh, 45 miles an hour. And I had a problem getting up the silt too. And that's the Christmas coach. So, I have lots and lots of plans for roller coasters next year and Ultimate Coast 2. Does everybody really like it? Uh, maybe in the future I'll end up with No Limits 2 or Planet Coaster, which are those two games I really want to have. And or Ultimate Coaster X, if I can get it on. Because I do have a big computer downstairs. So, let's see if you a giant overview. And. That happens. It doesn't matter. 
Because they don't crash, they go through each other, like ghosts. Unlike in some games, Roller Coaster Tycoon. Off ride. That's the best off ride on games. Well, hopefully, the next time I go with Carolyn's, I will film off rides so I can't bring more cameras and rides. Which I might explain that in a future video. So it's kind of a, a head chopper right there. And there's a new course. It's kind of slanted. And that is a 70 degree overbank bank curve. That close to the ground. I would love to experience that, being so close to the ground, and I like that. So that is the Christmas coaster. I'm going to wish you all a Merry Christmas, whoever celebrates it. I still have Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, and what I got for Christmas and highlights from 2020 to come out. And those will be the last videos of the year. I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye. Thank you.